Hello, my lovely Marshall Blenders. How are you? How are you? How are you? So here I am doing some crochet extensions. She's going on vacation, first year anniversary. And so we decided, yeah, let's do some crochet braids instead of the twist. For her wedding, I did some twists, natural hair twists. This time we decided to rock some extensions. So you'll notice that I will loop a, a nice section, not thick, not thin section from the front into the crochet uh, extension. And from there, I will start the braid. I'll do probably three uh i don't know if revolutions right uh, of the corn row and then i will add in another uh ex i will uh crochet in another extension three or three or four more revolutions and then another one so for the front i like to do three and that gives it a wonderful base a to start off with um but it also just makes it look a lot more like if it's an actual braid braid you know what i mean or an actual twist you'll see the end result at the end i have her um modeling it of course i do fill it in but this is just so you guys can see one of the techniques that i like to use for crochet braiding crochet extensions this was a lot of fun this was a lot this was my first time doing this technique on her it was like i, I was just trying to figure out you know that's the one thing about working with extensions is you're always coming up with different techniques there's like the old saying more than one way to skin a cat everybody kind of comes up with their own thing so here what i do after those three revolutions i will braid it up like do a little braid that way it doesn't loosen up and it actually makes it easier for me to loop that hair into the uh crochet braid the crochet extension see there i'm able to just loop it right in And then I will continue corn rowing. I'll continue corn rowing. And so, you know, you corn row the way you corn row. You know what I mean? Um, so it's, I'll do three more revolutions and then I will add in another um, crochet. And then I will braid it all the way down to the center, to the back. Um, I'm going to, I'm, this, I'm going to just have it be so you can see what I do. The next episode, I'm going to actually do uh, the show you everything else that I do, but a little bit sped up, of course, a little bit sped up because this did take me about a good hour and a half. The whole head it took me about an hour and a half, but it was so much fun. Have you guys done crochet braids? Have you thought of doing crochet braids? Let me know. Let me know what your experience has been with crochet braiding, either as a stylist or as a crochet braid wearer. Let me know what your thoughts are she really liked it because it feels so light um matter of fact let me tell you guys what hair i used um it, they, we used the v9 10 11 v-shape finish style passion twist i think that i don't know if that oh no it's um Zur, zuri the name is zuri z-u-r-y there you go that's what we used and so it is, they do come in tapered, like you have the 11 inch, the 10 inch, and the 9 inch. We only use the 11 and the 10. And there you go. You see that? There you go. Oh, I think she's feeling herself. And here, you really know she's feeling herself. What do you guys think of those end results? I love how it looks. She's able to pick it up. She's able to pull it back. She's able to wear it loose. She's able to wear it to the side so she has an option of partings to rock look at that look at that goodbye my lovely marshall blenders i'll see you soon